Hello, fellow language learners. My name is Jeff Watson, and I am lucky enough to be one of the English teachers here at the world's greatest website. It's called Verbling.com. You can connect and participate in a live English class 24 hours a day, seven days a week. <laughs> what, what an opportunity for everyone to improve their second language, to improve their English in, in this case. Uh, so this hour, I am going to uh, use some different teaching materials. So this is a new idea that uh, I hope that you will enjoy. And it is to talk about basic construction. All right. So, and the concept of do it yourself. And so, and I think you can learn a lot of English yourself as well. If you learn how to learn a second language, then you can do a lot of it yourself for free. But uh, let's talk about basic construction. And I would also like to talk about the tradition of building a deck on your house in Canada. I am from Vancouver. And so having a deck uh, built usually in the backyard, so behind the house, you build a deck. This is a great place to have a party, to have a, a barbecue, and to enjoy uh, a sunny day. And so this is what we can talk about. And so uh, I hope that everyone can download the document that I have prepared. We have lots and lots of photographs, we have some diagrams, and we have some videos to watch. It's called H8 is the document, and uh, you can download it directly from the verbling.com website. And so we have lots of people here, and uh, just if I can ask everyone to keep their microphone muted as much as possible so we can eliminate the noise. And uh, what I would like to do is to start with the, um, with the class. I would like to start by opening and reviewing the document. I have lots of pictures of decks. And so I would like your individual opinions of what these look like. And uh, if you have a similar tradition in your country. And again, if people can please keep their microphones muted, please, so we avoid that background noise. So everyone, please turn off their microphone. And what I'm going to do is uh, bring up the screen share. And here it is. And so, uh, Ahmed, what do you think of this deck here? Uh, sorry, Jeff, but I'm still hearing some noises from uh, Vivian's mic. So, oh, Ms. Vivian, I, I, would you yeah, mute it, please? I, yes, uh, and so, good, thank you. I've, uh, I've been muting her microphone. And, and so, I think that's better, isn't it? <laughs> it's still on, but it's okay. We could oh, deal oh, with okay. it. Oh, okay, sorry. Yeah. Uh, Vivian, are you there? Carva, Carvalho? Yes? Okay. Can you please turn off your microphone, please? Yeah. I'm I'm muting her microphone. She has an immunity, you know. Yeah. You can to mute her mic. Yes, uh, I I can mute her microphone, and maybe she has a a microphone. No, I tried to. Yeah. Let's uh, let's let's continue, Ahmed. Uh, what what do you think? Yes. This is a deck here. Yeah. Mm, I can see it. Oh, you can't see it. Uh, it's on the screen share. 
Ah, I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh, or Bruno has posted, thanks Bruno, he has posted the link to no the problem. document. Uh, Viviane? Yes, I, I got it. I can see it. Uh, I, we cannot hear you, but you need to keep your microphone turned off, please. Please keep your microphone turned off for us. Okay, I, I, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm going to uh, have you leave the class. I'm sorry. Okay, so let's let's continue. Ahmed, uh, do you yes, see sir. the picture now? Yes, I can see it clearly. Okay, and so uh, it, do you have something in your country that's similar uh, and outdoor space for people to have a party or have a barbecue? No, actually we can uh, just uh, see this in the countryside. But uh, ah, here okay. in uh, Alexandria, you can't see uh, kind, uh, these kind of things. But actually it's very nice to have uh, something like that, to smell fresh air and to have uh, uh, any kind of parties. So yeah. it's very interesting. Okay, great. You, you can't go up onto the roofs of your buildings? Yes, and jump too as well, but um, <laughs> we have nothing else. <laughs> oh, but not jumping, but yeah, okay. Uh, I did that quite a bit. Uh, yeah, great. So, thank you. And and Bruno. You. Hello, Bruno. Hi there, Jeff. <laughs> uh, uh, so, how where, where are you connecting from? Yeah, Jeff. from Brazil? Yeah. Jeff, okay. And from okay, Brazil, so, south, south Brazil. Uh, what do you think of this deck? Uh, I think it's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is, this is a nice one. All right. Yeah, and, uh, Okay. Now, could could you build this? I don't think so. I'm no. more of a computer guy. And <laughs> I, I really <laughs> like it. I could probably design it, but I, I, I wouldn't be able to build it, actually. <laughs> I would okay, pay someone well, to. All right, we're, we're going to look at how you can do it. So, all right. Okay. And then, do the people in Brazil have something like this? Uh, a place where it's close to the house? Uh, um, that's not very common. Uh, mm -hmm. I suppose there are some some places with that, but uh, I don't think that's uh, something common. Okay, all right, great. And so, Fad, are you there? Yes, yes, hi. Okay, great. And so, what do you, what do you think of this one here? Yeah, this one is very nice. But yeah. the, the, the previous one is, is better, I think. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's that's very fancy. The the previous one. Yeah. Very very. I like this one because it does not have railings, so it's it's a little dangerous, but it does not have the railings, which I like. Yeah. Like, yeah. Actually, we can't have like this in the Middle East. The yes. weather is the weather is a very big problem here. Okay. The hurts most of the time. Dusty stuff like that. So it's more comfortable inside the house? Yes. Yeah. Inside okay. with air conditioning is, is okay. good for us. <laughs> All right, good. And in Canada, of course, every time the sun shines, we want to go outside and enjoy it because it's a luxury to have a nice warm day. It, it, it's not that common. All right, great. Yeah, it's not fifty. It's not fifty degrees. <laughs> okay, right. yeah. No, it, it might be fifty below, but uh, it never <laughs> gets fifty degrees, right? Okay. And Francisco, are you there? Yes, I am. Okay. So, what do you think of this one? Uh, I think it's a beautiful place for yeah. okay to live for to live. Sure. And I think is the person who has these places, these houses, very rich. Well, okay, yeah, all right, good. And and then, but we want to focus on just having a little space to sit outside and uh, have something to drink. Or it, is that common in your country uh, to have a little place where you can sit outside? A terrace yeah, it, or a patio. It's, common. Mm -hmm. it's it's very common to have to 
chairs. Yeah. Um, one uh, table. Um, table. One table and two glasses. Yeah. Great. Okay. Outside the house. Good. Good. Excellent. And the easy access. You have uh, a door right there, and so it's very easy. And honey, are you there? Oh yes. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. So, what do you what do you think of this one? It's a nice one, but uh, we don't have in our uh, home. Right. And we so have, uh, a big garden, but uh, without the uh, the problem. Oh, okay. So you do have a garden. Yes, of course. Now, uh, yeah, but uh, now when you say garden, do you mean the grass here? Or do you mean flowers planted? A grass and uh, a flower around it. Okay. You know, and technically, in English, the grass here is the yard, the backyard in this case. But people like to build uh, a deck or a patio because it's dry, it's easy to put chairs there. Yeah, it's... Uh, it's we we have a ground. Uh, what uh, I can? Sorry, the people uh, build uh, build a ground and. Uh, what what do they build? Sorry, could you repeat what you said? I said uh, the people uh, build a ground, not uh, not from uh, not like this. It's uh, just. Uh, I can't remember the word, okay? Yeah, okay, sorry. It's just on the ground? Yes, yes. We have yeah. a ground, not exactly. Yeah, just the flat ground. Okay. Yeah, yeah that's more like a, a patio, perhaps. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah in, in Canada, we often build the deck because you just, uh, things are wet from the rain, etc. The ground is soft, and so it, it's not easy to do things in the backyard, but it's very easy to have uh, invite people to do things on the back deck. All right, yes, great. We don't have much rain. Thank you. Yeah, no, 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 that's fine. <laughs> Thank you. No, this is part of the North American tradition, building a big deck. All right, and Julissa, that's hello. That's nice. Hi again. Uh, well, the first picture looks like a bal balcony, right? It's something like that. Yeah, a it's little small. bit like a balcony. Yeah. So even people who live in a in an apartment, they mm -hmm. have a balcony. Yes. Mm -hmm. I think there's a the, couple more. In the countryside, it would be very nice to have this for the view that you can you can see. <clears throat> yeah. yeah. Right. Yeah, they're, they're definitely spaces for socializing. And, uh, and then people, uh, the, the one deck is very nice there, the one on the left, with all of the different levels. So kind of a combination garden. Uh, planters, the places with the earth and the, and the plants are called planters. Yeah, great. All right, and so I'll I'll uh, move on. Hello, uh, is is it Khaled? You need to turn on your microphone, Khaled. Uh, we we still can't hear you. Click on the screen on the Google Hangout screen. There is a button that you can click on to turn on your microphone. And and so I'll, I'll I'll let you sort that out. Uh, Mohammed, are you there? Yeah, I'm there. You hear me? Yes, good. And so, uh, please, what do you think of the idea of having a deck? And here is a proud construction worker. <laughs> yeah, I think it's a, it's a good idea to have something like this in your backyard. Okay, and perfect. It's a, it's. Give the house uh, uh, a beauty, and also it's very nice to relax when you have it. Uh, a hard day in job, 
that, you know. A hard day at work, yeah, yeah. absolutely, yeah, if, go if back. the weather is nice. Yeah, and go back at home, enjoy your time in, and relax in the back, yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. And, and so I want to try and focus on vocabulary a bit, and so this, this guy has built a deck. Yeah. And uh, what are these here, where people sit on them? So instead of putting railings, he has built, I actually put it in the chat box, a bench. And then what has he built here, if you can see my cursor? What are these? Anybody? <laughs> Those are the planters. So you could put soil in there and uh, put some plants in there, I guess, is the idea, or some flowers. All right, great. And so what, what I would like to do is to start now by... Uh, going to a video and so just while I'm get finding the link that I want to show you <clears throat> has anyone had any experience doing some basic construction anybody please make some comments uh, while I find the link for the video not building a deck I just had some experience building my uh, I did myself a few uh, circuit boards to control uh, stepper motor and stuff like that, but nothing related to so some, uh, building a, a deck yeah. or something. Okay, all right. Anyone else <laughs> with some basic construction with lumber? I'm going to put the word lumber here. Lumber are the pieces of wood that are cut uh, to size so that they can be used to build something. And so lumber is the wood used to build the decks. So what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to post in uh, a YouTube link in the Verbling chat box and I'm going to go over on the left hand side of my screen and I, I'm sorry I just turned off the Verbling classes, the YouTube application, and I'm going to show uh, a video. This is actually from Britain, so I'm assuming from England. They use a little bit of different vocabulary, but I'm going to play a minute or two of this video. So if people can listen, obviously I would like you to focus on understanding the general concept but try to capture some of the vocabulary that he is using. And
<laughs> okay, and so let's just stop there for a second. How are we doing? And, and this is my philosophy for teaching English. So if you're interested in learning the vocabulary to, that has to do with basic construction, it's all here. You don't need to buy an English textbook <laughs> because all these videos, it's full of the vocabulary that you need to use. And so these are the tubes. You can cut them with a handsaw. You dig a hole. You put in the tube. You add in gravel, the rocks, the small rocks. Then you mix your cement or your concrete and you can purchase this quick setting concrete. It's very strong and it hardens quickly. And then you're going to put in a, uh, uh, some hardware, some metal hardware uh, at the end. So let me just play a little bit more of this video here. Hey, people. Hi. Okay, and let's, let's stop there for a minute. So this is the idea behind the class. So uh, Edmar thinks it's cool. Uh, what are some of the other people's uh, uh, comments here at this point? Uh-oh, <laughs> we've got problems here. <laughs> This is, these are the footings of your deck. Anybody? Hi. Hi. Yes. Hello. Hi. Hi. Hello. We, we can hear you. Hello. Hello. <laughs> we, yes, we can hear you. Uh, uh, Khaled? Hi, Mr. Yes, uh, uh, and so do you have a yes. comment, Khaled? Okay, wait. Yeah, and I, I'm just going to ask you, while you're organizing you, yourself, please, if you can keep your microphone turned off. So uh, please help me, students. Uh, this is a different idea. Please help me. <laughs> so this is the foundation. So of a house, you need to start with the foundation. And so if you're going to build a deck, you need to start by building the footings. This is the secure foundation for your deck. So any, any ideas? No? You, you can do this. <laughs> I don't know. Jeff, <laughs> okay. I'm in big trouble here. Okay. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> well, no, but uh, I, I, uh, I'm not asking for anything really um, technical. Just, do you think you could do this? Um, is yeah, this it's easy to does this look the, uh, easy to do? do? Do you understand the video? Uh, yeah. Yes, I understand it, um, but I. Sorry. I go understand. ahead. Thank, thank you, Bruno. Yeah. I don't know. I, I guess I have. Uh, the delay on the video. Are you here listening to me? We can hear you. There is a big delay between your video and your sound. You, you may want to turn off your video to improve your connection. But what what I'll what I'll can, do is I'll can you I'll hear me now? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so Karina gets okay. extra marks. I, she is I'm saying Samir. that the, the foundation is very important. And uh, 
Yeah, great. But go ahead, Bruno. Hi, Mr. Okay, can you hear me? Yes, we can. Okay, sorry. Uh, I'm familiar with uh, the terms because I, I play a game called Minecraft and I build stuff with my friends and um, I, we use many technical terms and I think it would be easy following uh, the steps on the video to build uh, a, a, a footprint for a deck I would be yeah great okay and now uh, what I'd like to do is to uh, sh do the screen share and bring up some of the diagrams. Now, I, I think this diagram is maybe the best one here. And so uh, let's let's take a look. Oops, where is it here? Okay. And then before we watch the next video, um, what? Uh, let's review some of these boards here. Some of the lumber that's used. And so would would anyone? like to point out some of the structures that they understand? Just turn on your microphone and... Hi. Yes? Yes? Khalid? Can you hear me? Yes, we can. Could you read some of the vocabulary that we have here? Uh, decking. Decking, uh, yes. Those decking. are the boards that are on top. Good. Joist. The Le joists. Le joist. Yes. Okay. Board, ledger, theme, post. Yeah, the ledger board we will see is very important. The ledger board is the connection between the house and the deck. Go ahead, please. You're doing a great job. Continue. Go ahead, please. Continue, please. Uh, post, anchor, anchor. Anchor. Sorry, the anchor, the anchor. 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 That is the piece of metal that we saw being put into the footing, the poured footing. Poured footing. Rickmond Joist, a ticket, cap rail. Yeah, cap rail. Now, those words, those words are not that useful in everyday uh, English because we usually say the railing. All of that structure is called the railing. All right? And so what, what I'd like to do is to move down and then let's just take a look at this here. So can someone else point out some of the structures here? Uh, what's what's this called? Could I get another student to read out what this is? What this is? Yes, so uh, uh, I'm going to ask some of the other students to participate, Khalid. So could you please mute your microphone now, please? Thank you. Okay. Yeah, and so what about the structures here that you see in this deck? What's this? Is it a post? Anyone, please uh, help me. They are, uh, post the anchor post. The yeah, post. That's, these are the posts. No, sorry, these are the posts. Well, no, these are the posts. P O S T. Yeah. All right, and how about? This structure, whoops, sorry, let me just, this structure here. Anybody remember? Ribbon joist. Uh, sorry, no, it's not. Uh, this is the beam. Okay, and, and I, I'm trying to pick the words that are most common. Uh, and, and, you know, this is, I, I'm not going to focus on very specific uh, vocabulary, but 
you know, a lot of things are built with a post. This is a very common word. You'll use it all the time. And then beams are horizontal. And then the metal fixtures here, what, what are these metal fasteners called? Anybody know? <laughs> Anybody? So they're bolts and they're fastened with nuts. So it's bolted. The posts are bolted to the beam. So this is really a good construction. And then how about up here? These boards here, what are these called? Uh, joists. Those are Ducking. the joists. No, sorry, the decking, we can't see the decking. So let me, the decking is on top. These are the joists. You have the posts. You have the beam. You have the footings and the anchors. You have the railings. And you have the ledger board which is this connection between the deck and the house. Okay, so everybody's ready. Let's, uh, <laughs> uh, how are we doing? Any comments from people? I enlighten it. I'm learning a lot about construction. Yeah, well, and, and I think that this, uh, I, I don't necessarily want to teach you construction, but I want to, to teach students how to learn English, yeah, sure. <laughs> you know? Uh, and, I'm, yeah. thinking, I'm, I'm learning English and yeah. also I'm learning how to build a deck. <laughs> yeah, okay, all right. But then what you do is choose whatever you want to learn and start looking at YouTube videos. Go to Google Image and look at the diagrams with the vocabulary. Uh, start listening to the audio start reading articles and this is how you develop your vocabulary but uh, let's try another YouTube video uh, and uh, uh, this is I put it in the uh, Verbling chat box so let me show you another video and through repetition you can learn these words if, if you want <laughs> Yeah, this is a good one here.
Okay. Everyone can build this one, right? <laughs> Comments? Yeah. Mohammed? Yeah, it's, uh, it's easy. It's build one like this. If you have the materials. Yes, you good. Have, you have, then you have the space in your layout. And, and you have some tools. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's really interesting. Okay. And you want to make sure it's nice and square. You want yeah. to make sure it's level. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You are treating the wood with a preservative. Yeah. Okay. Uh, any other uh, comments with the vocabulary? I think it's yes. a little bit difficult Francisco? to develop. I think it's a bit of, a little bit difficult to develop it. To develop? Yeah, I think okay. so. Okay, but sorry, to build this? Yeah, to build um, this. For me, okay. yeah, it's and very difficult. Okay, but why? What would you find difficult? Because I don't have the tools. Um, okay. It's all. <laughs> yeah, no, no. It, it's it's a big investment to have good tools, but yeah. yeah. But if you take more time and have a good handsaw, you you could build this with with a handsaw. It it wouldn't be perfect, but yeah, okay. There are many accidents with the tools. With power tools. I think so. Yeah, yeah. You need to be careful using power tools. I think protecting your eyes is probably the most important thing with with power tools. Do you okay. know if it's expensive to to hire a person who make it to to make it? Yes. Well, you see, this is this is the problem with uh, no no this is the reason behind do it yourself this is something that's very popular in North America and typically it, it, it's with these kinds of projects it's typically men who do these projects and it's that they collect the tools and they borrow the tools from their friends and everyone builds a deck for their house. It's something that you do. To hire someone to do it is kind of strange. It, it's a cultural thing. It's not just the money because it would be expensive for someone to build it. But people want to ha build it themselves because when you invite people over and they're on the deck, you say, I built this. It, it's part of what people want to do. I think. Okay. Yeah. Here in yeah. Mexico, the person who make this kind of work is called a uh, carpintero. A carpenter. Carpenter? Oh. Now, in English, carpenter is more uh, f beautiful finishing work, like they may make furniture. So this would be a builder. Uh, yeah, this, this kind of work would be a builder. Okay. Uh, I, I, let's let's I show to, a little bit I want more. To ask yeah. what, uh, yes, go ahead. Please. Is, if uh, joiner like carpenter? A joiner? Yes. Sorry, no, I think, yeah, well, sorry, yes, a furniture maker. Uh, I, I'm not familiar with joiner, really, it's but a same. carpenter, a furniture maker, these are the people who are really skilled and can make something that's beautiful. But a deck is, you don't need to make it look beautiful. It, it doesn't have to be perfect. And so can someone practice their vocabulary here with this photograph? Anybody? What, what are these? Joints. <laughs> the joists. Yeah, the, and joists, we say yeah, right, floor, 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 floor joists in in a house, and this one is called the rim joist, the one on the outside. Yeah. This is a very important one. 
What about these? Posts. Yeah. Posts. What about this? What about these? Footings. Yeah, the, the footings. cement footings. Okay, and really that's it. Then there's the ledger plate, which is connected to the foundation of the house. So you have to make sure to do a good job connecting this to the house. All right, let's go up a little bit. Here's another job where, where they've got a little bit of the decking on it. And what are these pieces called? The beams. The beams. And sometimes in a house, you can see this construction in the roof. So there are rooms when you walk into a house and you can see the posts and beams that make up the construction. And then the rim joist holds everything together. All right, here's another look at the post and beam. It's bolted. Here are the joists. What's this called? What are these boards called? We're looking okay. from the bottom. Sorry? The decking. The decking, yeah. yeah. And then they have the railings built up here. Okay, the railings. All right, great. And this is the ledger plate. So this is the connection between the deck and the house. These are called hangers, these metal pieces. Metal pieces of metal hardware to hang the joists and the decking. All right. This, I think this is the difficult step here, connecting yeah. the decking yeah. to the house. Yes, yeah. yeah. And I, I, like, I like the idea in, the, in YouTube you showed us. They didn't connect the decking to the house. They used different spaces. Yes, good. Yeah, so th good. this is a good idea, I think, because connecting the decking to the house, I think, I think will, will harm the house. If you if you if you gonna if you gonna take take the decking off later, you you have to do it right, and flashing refers to the metal piece that keeps water from going between the the wood, so uh, and keeps water from perhaps even going into the house. So I agree, you need to do this step correctly. You, you need to do this correct steply. Uh, uh, sorry, this step correctly. But to have, you can see by the pictures, you know, uh, having the deck connected to the house, you know, this is a really important part of the deck. So these are as a slide. This is a uh, sliding glass door, and so you walk right from the house out onto the deck and so this is you know this is what you want and and somebody has their barbecue here so you can walk from the kitchen you can barbecue dinner and then walk back into the kitchen and serve dinner and so yeah it makes makes the deck really accessible uh, and then this picture here which is kind of a, a perfect situation of having uh, a deck that looks out over a beautiful place like this. Yeah, and so let's let's take a look at uh, at another video. Any comments from people? Can you buy lumber like this? Are houses made of of lumber like this? The different boards. Is this common in your country? It will be great. Yeah? Okay, it would be great, but it's it's not common then? No, it's all. Oh, okay, but uh, yeah, okay. And now I'm going to put another video here so we can watch a little bit more. I'm going to start up the YouTube here. 
And I hope that people can hear this. If not, please watch the YouTube video in a separate window. Here we go. Hi. Okay, so yeah, great. Uh, we are watching a video right now. I'm sorry. And, and so what you can do is access the YouTube video from the link that we have put in the Verbling chat box. And so any comments from people? You're, you're experts already, right? Yeah, right. <laughs> no, but seriously, can you hear the words? He's talking about footings. The yeah. joists, the joist hangers, the beam. There's two different positions for the beam. Yes? Yes, I can uh, hear it and understand it. <laughs> okay, all right, great. great. I'm ready to build my own bed. <laughs> well, this is it, exactly. Let's, let's go, let's watch a bit more. So we've got the ledger board connected to the house. We've got flashing over top to stop rainwater going in between the ledger board and the house. That's a bad thing. You've got the posts. You've got the footings. You've got the beam. You've got the joists. You've nailed on the joist hangers. Okay, we're, we're happening here. Hi.
Okay. <laughs> so they this is very simple, uh, but it's not that simple because then you need to build the railings. That's much more complicated. And then if you want to build stairs, that's really complicated. But the decking, we can do that. We can do that. Yeah. So uh, any any comments? Uh, and maybe uh, hello and Antonio. Any any comments from you? What what do you think? Uh, and and if people don't want to comment about the construction, that's fine. But how about people learning how to do things from YouTube? People can comment on that if they want. So go ahead, Antonio. Yes. Uh, uh, hi. Uh, <coughs> I think it's very useful to to learn in internet and YouTube to do all all this stuff. Um, I was thinking about you said before the to to do and 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 how do you say step? Yeah, the stairs to build stairs. The stairs. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, it's I I I hear that uh, to to do to to make a. A stair, you have to use uh, a proportion in, in between the size of the steps, because if you don't, if you <laughs> don't put in this proportion, the the people yeah. can can fall. No, you you actually That's... have to do some accurate measuring and use some math. Uh, it's basic math, but yeah, you need to divide it and make the stairs approximately the regulation height mm -hmm. and and the same height it's very dangerous to have stairs of different heights if people will fall people yes. will slip and fall yeah great excellent <laughs> it's a big it's a big challenge getting that right uh, uh, Bruno a, a comment from you please uh, I, I I don't have much to say. I I got the, what the videos said. Uh, mm -hmm. I guess I could uh, build a deck if I had space <laughs> and, and and the tools. Yeah. Uh, I really would like to, and probably I will do someday. Yeah. Uh, and just that. How about learning from YouTube? Have you learned anything from YouTube? Actually, most of, I, of, of what I know, I learned from internet uh, and some from YouTube, but mainly from other websites with tutorials and stuff. Um, yeah. I'm from IT, so uh, it's come yeah. in our yeah. kind of obvious yeah. that it's going to be on the internet. Great. Yeah. <laughs> Fad, uh, a comment from you? Yes, uh, actually, I would like you to go shopping tomorrow. <laughs> and get the get the materials and start my decking tomorrow morning. Okay. <laughs> All right, and you can build a, a roof for shade. Yeah, that's right. To, to provide shade. All right, great, yeah. excellent. Thank you. And and Fran Francisco, a comment from you. Um, I think this well, it, this class was very. Helpfully for to learn some words in English. I like it. Oh, this this is the Thank way you. to learn vocabulary. Please don't study lists of vocabulary. Just uh, watch videos and learn learn the learn how to use the the words. Yeah, great. Thank Adi, you. Uh, are you there? Okay. Yes. Uh... I like to say it's a new idea for me because uh, we don't uh, build from wood. We use the concrete uh, uh, for everything here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, just a, a cement patio. Yeah. Yeah. So that's uh, nice to hear about that with you, and I can say nothing. No, and, and this is a huge Canadian tradition, so if you ever go to Canada, you'll be invited to a barbecue someday on someone's deck, for sure. Oh, and they'll tell you right. how they built it. <laughs> oh. All right. And, and Khaled, uh, a comment from you? Uh, Khaled? Yes. Yes, yes. Uh, a comment from you? 
What's would the you, question? Yes, would you like to make a comment? Have you learned something by watching YouTube? Yes, yes, uh, I watch a short uh, film. And, short uh, video. Yeah. Yes. Good, thank you. Okay, I, I have to go. I'm teaching again right away. Uh, happy English learning, you guys, and uh, good luck with your next construction project. Take care. Okay, thank you for your time. Yeah. Thank you very much. Bye. Thanks to Verbling. <laughs> okay. Thank you, yes.